Everyone ready? Yeah, this first. Powered AM waves. Welcome to the first Saturday matinee of 2022. Woo! Um, I'm uh, sort of by myself today. What? And hey, this is hey. being recorded ahead of time. No, it isn't. Liar. <clears throat> Although it's as live as I could make it. Um, this next song is uh, the fairest of them all, and this is this was the first track off of the Distance of the Moon at Daybreak, which was our second album. There's some definitions of our. When I was young, I wandered straight from where I was. Oh. 
Uh, this next song, my friend Rob kind of reminded me of it the other day when he was, he was talking about a song he wrote about Baltimore and he said, you know, most people have a complicated relationship with their hometown and if you say you don't, you might be lying to yourself a little bit. And I, I think most people who live in Baltimore have a complicated relationship with it. It's called Can't Swim in the Harbor. John's gone to town with his shoes caked in dirt Jane's made a mess on his hundred dollar shirt Paid himself a fight and made himself a mom the 
This next song I'm going to do, um, 2015 was the first time that I actually released a FOM album. I had written a February album, Writing Month album in 2013 and 2014, but I didn't release the songs. Um, so usually it takes me a few songs to get going, but I, re I really liked the first song I wrote that month and I still play it. It's called um, Oh Brother Ain't It Hard, oh, and it's about, you know, Maybe getting over depression, which is something that affects a lot of people during winter. It was bacon and eggs every Sunday morning to the lock God changed without. It's hard to hear the sound of the water when you drown. It's hard to hear a storm rolling in. Oh, brother, ain't it hard when you haven't got a dollar? Ain't it hard every day to feel small? Ain't it hard, oh, brother? I've been trying to do a folk song um, pretty much every week, um, at least every week that I that I do these on my own. But um, uh, s next song we're going to do, Twa Corby's. I had rewritten it uh, for The Distance of the Moon at Daybreak, and I rewrote it as a couple people standing on the side of the road discussing how they're going to 
um, rob somebody. And um, in the original song, it's two crows on a on a road or a beach somewhere, uh, talking about where they're going to go get lunch. And one of them says, "Hey, there's a knight dead in the ditch over there. Let's go eat him." <laughs> Pretty gruesome song. Uh, the words for this are actually from the 1800s. This is this is technically a literary version of the, of the ballad. The the actual song itself might be older, but the words that everyone does now are not as old as many people think they are. They just sound old. we've come to our final song of the day and this is fireworks at the carnival Yay. 
This song is really the reason I made the band Midway Fair. It was great. nice to have yeah. something to say finally for after a while. We call the cross Saturday.
Thank you very much. Have a wonderful new year.